Well, we've been telling you about many liberal cities and environmentalists that are pushing to ban plastic straws, but it turns out it doesn't end there. Now they are sounding the alarm about how you are harming, excuse me, how you're harm, harming the planet with your contact lenses. Well, Kelsey Harkness is a senior reporter with The Daily Signal, and she joins us now to weigh in. Hey, Kelsey, thanks for joining us. Good morning. Good morning. So tell us what's the latest with contact lenses, because a lot of people, millions of people across America wear contact lenses. Well, according to this new study, environmentalists are raising the alarms about Americans flushing their contact lenses down the toilet, arguing that it's bad for the environment. And look, there's nothing actually wrong with researchers looking into the effects of our contact lenses being flushed down the toilet. But what we've seen time and time again is environmentalists weaponize this type of research to pass ridiculous regulations, like what we just saw in California, where you can actually face jail time for distributing straws. I guess we all want to, I know, we all want to take care of our environment, but we want to focus on the right things. How big of a problem is this? In the grand scheme of things, this is not a big problem. If you want to talk about large environmental problems, let's look at the waste that countries like China are releasing into our waters. Uh, the, the effects of contact lenses being flushed down the toilet is minuscule compared to that. And again, it's reasonable to ask Americans to uh, throw away their contact lenses in the trash instead of flushing them down the toilet. But in the grand scheme of things, passing more regulations will only be harmful to small businesses, it'll be harmful to the economy, and it's not going to make a big difference environmentally. How dangerous is this when, when big government steps in and they want to regulate everything? Just look at what's happening in California with the plastic straw ban and what we actually see when companies like Starbucks attempt to get rid of their straws, they replace them with materials, what we call adult sippy cups, which actually use more plastic than, than simple, simply using plastic straws. Um, so I think we need to um, go about environmental regulations uh, very carefully and actually look at what President Trump is doing today when he is announcing steps to roll back and replace President President Obama's clean power plan. All right, Kelsey, thanks for joining us. Thank you. You're welcome.